Detox diets are all the rage right now. Yeah, but what about a detox for your face if you wear makeup? One New York City doctor says you probably need one. Fox 5's Liz Dollum checked out the procedure. Here it is. I'm just going to ask you to open and close a few times, please, Michelle. Sheila McGaffrey sits for a few hours hooked up to an IV once a week. A little bit of a pen. She's getting chelation therapy, which helps remove toxic heavy metals from the body. Sheila has been diagnosed with high levels of lead, aluminum, and mercury. She believes the main culprit has been her favorite beauty products. So what I use is face cream. I use lipstick, lip pencil, mm -hmm. concealer, mm -hmm. um, eyeshadow, mascara. Any issues, any side effects? Sheila's physician, Dr. Salerno, says makeup companies aren't required to list contaminants on labels. They can affect our nervous systems, they can cause fatigue, they can cause headaches, dermatitis, problems with reproduction. So you might be thinking, I don't use that much makeup and how worried do I have to be? Well, doctors say the average woman absorbs about five pounds of makeup into her skin every year. The skin being the largest organ in the body is absorbing these heavy metals and on a continual basis it, it will accumulate. Patients like Sheila are now resorting to chelation. The FDA approved treatment occurs over the course of 10 $250 sessions. Patients get a mixture of vitamins including calcium EDTA which binds to the heavy metals and flushes them out. We're going to run you slow. Sheila says the first treatment left her feeling flu-like, but now she swapped out all of her makeup for lead-free products, watches what she eats, and feels better. It's a powerful energy, and it's kind of, you don't know what you're lacking until you get it back again. Mm -hmm. So it's made all the difference in the world. We say routine testing of heavy metals is really critical because even if you're feeling well, you may not be feeling optimized. So with Sheila, she was feeling well. Now she's getting to the point where she's feeling like she did when she was in her 20s. From Midtown Manhattan, Liz Dollum, Fox 5 News.